Is it possible to switch from the normal remote control to the smart remote control to use the voice commands in the Samsung 4K TVs? Well, stick around and let's find out. Hello YouTubers, how are you guys? We got an amazing video for you today. I'm very anxious to show you a great idea how to switch to your normal remote control to the smart remote control with voice commands. As you know, we made to the secret menu a lot of tutorials and a lot of ideas including how to connect your headphones to your Samsung uh, Smart TVs, the full HD versions and the 4K TVs. We have a lot of tutorials on blocking features to the Samsung TVs that were blocked from the factory by the manufacturer Samsung and we teach you uh, even if in the previous weeks how to connect a, a mini system to your TV as a soundbar and control it only with one remote control. We teach you how to make a sound mirroring from your TV and use it as a soundbar with the built-in speakers even. Um, we showed a lot of ideas uh, about uh, connecting mini keyboards to these TVs and now guys it's possible to connect and I switch to a smart remote control from the normal remote control with the secret menu with uh, this 4K TV. First of all, your TV must have Bluetooth. Was in the video which we have uh, 1.3, 1.4 million views, um, some users reported that their TVs do not work because uh, some of their TVs do not have Bluetooth integrated. It's called BTHID, Bluetooth HID. And in the Samsung website, if your model do not have into the specification Bluetooth HID, the BT HID, well, it will not work. These new remote controls, you can buy them with $25, $30 or something like this. And um, they come with two communication methods. One is with the infrared, which has in the front, and the other uh, has implemented the Bluetooth system integrated that communicates with the TV in a long range. So I showed you last week that the TV transmits to the remote control and information by Bluetooth and you can send by the infrared in your uh, mini system and you can control it. Well, uh, this function and you can switch from the uh, buttons, normal buttons, remote control to the smart remote control only if the, your TV has Bluetooth integrated. And guys, please be careful in the secret menu what you are changing because even if it's a, a factory default button you can permanently damage your tv because that factory button will not help you so what you have changed make a picture with the mobile phone because um, you will forget that function and you will not know how to restore it so be aware be aware change only what we are telling in this video to change so guys let's begin now guys we have the normal remote control and first to get into the secret menu you have to press a combination of buttons if you don't know we have a complete tutorial in our videos you can feel free to check it out for now press directed to the tv the info menu mute and power on while your tv it's off and while your tv it's off press this combination info menu mute and power on quickly do not stay too long because this is another uh, trick and you will see the Samsung logo and right here is the secret menu let's focalize so this is the secret menu guys and I'm saying once again be very careful what you are changing change only what we are telling to change so we have a lot of functions here we can view for those of you who are new into this uh, TVs to, into the secret menu please be careful because it has a lot and a lot of options we are interested in this function to change from the normal remote control and you can use your rem normal remote control to change these things you can use the arrows of the remote control and uh, then you we will see how to pair the smart remote control and if we are interested and in go into the option menu 
go into the Mi Air T and here we have all the options we are interested in okay so we have bluetooth support bt support and click it on now go back and we have a bluetooth address this means that the tv has a bluetooth integrated uh, to some of you if uh, it will not tell you a bluetooth address it must be possible that your tv doesn't have a bluetooth uh, hardware integrated in your tv and then guys uh, we are interested in smart control and click it on put it on the smart control and uh, if you have the smart view also you must click it on uh, to some of you maybe you will have uh, by default these values to on some of you you will not have them and now to continue voice recognition click it to on switch it to on and this is pretty much it uh, what you have to do into the secret menu now let's see how to pair the mm, smart remote control to confirm this uh, changes you have to close your tv so power it off and this is it and if your remote control does not work and you try to do something and it does not work this means that is not paired so hold these buttons the back button and the play button for i don't know uh, five seconds and it started to search for the devices and it found the remote control pairing complete so this is how you will pair your smart remote control the other way searching for the menu it's not possible to pair the this remote control and if you are seeing guys now my remote control my smart remote control works flawlessly it doesn't have any problem and even i can use the voice commands from it to some models of samsung it has somewhere you can search in the general i don't know exactly where it is but is into the menu you can search for the remote control to pair it it has a function somewhere but if you are turning on the bluetooth exactly like i showed you into the secret menu and use this uh, uh, shortcut it will automatically pair with uh, your uh, smart tv so now let's see the voice function because this is what we are interested in volume 30 and it asks us because it's very loud to change it and it changed the volume to 40 volume 20 and it set the volume on 20 percent if we want for to search something like um, let's see i technology reviews so i clicked on this button and i'm holding the microphone button and it search the i technology reviews or you can search all kinds of in english of course you can search what you, you are interested in youtube and it's, this is very good uh, uh, beside this keyboard that you have to press every letter every digit you can communicate with the remote control and the tv will take the command the tv has a built-in sensor that um, knows how is the light in the room and will automatically uh, dim your light uh, depending on your light source power saving mode medium but uh, you can use this function to control your tv and uh, tell uh, to dim the light if it's uh, night for example power saving mode high and it reduces the uh, luminance or the light of your tv not to bother someone when he is sleeping at night power saving mode off now the power saving gets uh, off and let's see how many commands can this tv support um, involving your tv if it's a smart tv can support some commands some of uh, other tvs cannot support commands guys so please do not get upset if you, uh, uh, this video or this tutorial will not work on your model tv because uh, you know expensive tvs have a lot of features built in some cheap tvs do not have um, all the functions needed for this tutorial you can say to the remote control go to the live tv channel list smart hub home guide schedule manager it has a lot of uh, uh, view info netflix 
and it switches automatically to the Netflix application. If you have a Netflix application, of course, the Netflix application do not have uh, voice control support for the voice control. You can even manage your colors. You can tell the TV to contrast 70%. And the uh, contrast was set to 70%. You can uh, talk with your TV, it has a lot of functions. And uh, this is what it's great, the voice command for the 4K TVs. You can do searches on the web. It doesn't understand uh, everything in the search function for the web, for example. But you figure it out, the idea. And uh, I think it's quite cool that uh, in the YouTube you can search with the voice and uh, not type every letter so guys feel free to check out uh, this tutorial i hope it helps you turn off with this function guys i'm gonna power off the tv and you can even turn off your tv and do all kinds of uh, things it's very intelligible this uh, voice recognition function I hope you like this tutorial guys, I hope uh, it helped you, please thumbs up for us, uh, click that like button and uh, put the notification bell when you subscribe to our channel. Thank you for watching, have a great day, bye, see you.